Four countries responsible for water resources are in Lesotho for the meeting of the Orange Sengu River Commission or SACOM forum. They include ministers from South Africa, Botswana, Lesotho and Namibia. They have signed a revised agreement of Orasacom and Botswana has also handed over a rotational chairmanship to Lesotho. One river, four nations. This body is responsible for managing the transboundary water management, which provides a framework for managing water resources across national boundaries. I therefore look forward to appreciate progress on implementation of priority actions within the various transboundary cooperation arrangements over the basin as they exist. In addition, we as the Republic of Botswana are eager to see the conceptualization and fruition of the Lesotho Botswana Water Project as soon as practically possible. Botswana is handing over the rotational chairmanship to Lesotho. Upon receiving the chairmanship, Lesotho says there is a direct need to protect the wetlands. We build those dams with anticipation to grab water for us, but if we cannot take care of the wetlands, in the near future, we'll be struggling with our, our dams. I'm talking about both the existing dams and the anticipated dam uh, for, to, to take the water to Botswana. Our cooperation must rope in industry partners that benefit from Orange Sengu River system, including ordinary communities. Now, this, this river system is so important to all of us which is why this, this strategic partnership of the four nations, it just must work. It, it just can't afford not to work. It is therefore important that we as four sovereign states stand together on how to respond to these emerging challenges of water insecurity brought about by climate change and variability as it impacts heavily on socio-economic development. Namibia, while in full support of the agreement, could not yet sign the agreement due to the outstanding internal processes, but should ratify the agreement in early January. Rapelang Khatebe, SABC News, Maserulisudu.